Hey guys, making a short video about P16D0 code on a check engine code on a 2014 Chevy Malibu LS. As you can see, the check engine light is on. And I'm going to show you the code that came up that was took it to a mechanic and he read it as P16D0 he gave me a couple page printout as to diagnostics and that says intake rocker arm solenoid valve 2 stuck off and I took it to a dealership and pretty much they gave me the same thing this is a printout from Chevy dealership P16D0 we can just ignore other codes that didn't come up um, so the problem with this one, after a couple of days of troubleshooting, I couldn't find a video online, so I decided to make this one here. Basically, you just need to replace the intake solenoid valve. There's two of these. I already replaced this one, and that solved my problem. The car is running fine now. It's very simple to replace this part. It's as easy as replacing a spark plug, pretty much. To do that, you have to take these three screws, the hex wrench T30 size off. You have to, you need to remove this engine cover. And to do that, it's a horrible design. Other people have been complaining too about this one. You have to remove the engine oil cap off and then remove this cover okay be sure to put the engine oil cap right back on you don't want dirt getting inside there so this intake solenoid valve there's intake that's this one right here that's the intake one this piece that goes right in there and there's the exhaust uh, solenoid valve that's this one here so the difference between the two is the intake has this connector that's kind of yellow bright color and the exhaust the tip here is black so that's how you differentiate the two in order to change the intake solenoid valve you just have to remove this 10 millimeter bolt right there and I didn't even have to remove this um, air filter gosh what's this thing called anyways this top <coughs> cover you don't have to remove any of that so you just need to remove this 10 millimeter bolt and on this uh, wire connector you press you pull this thing up the white snap oh, it's already up so yeah you pull it back and you press it down hard and then you pull it out disconnected basically once you remove the 10 millimeter bolt uh, this thing you pull it out and you put the new one in this is the old one I already replaced it so you put that in there put the bolt back on and Put the connector back on. Uh, be sure when you put that in there, before you put, it's got the O-ring right here, the sealer. That's what seals it. And this is AC Delco brand. That's the box that came in. And the original, I believe, is AC Delco brand as well. So you put it in there. And once you got that done, uh, put the engine top cover back on and you start the car and that's the end of it and the price for this intake solenoid valve is around 37 38 dollars online the dealership quoted me a price of I will show you the receipt here they quoted me 51 list price 51.77 and with a student discount I paid $42.38, so pretty close to online price. I went ahead and picked it up from the